Hello and welcome to today's math lesson. For today's lesson, you will need, well, just three things. A pencil, a red color, in my case I have a red crayon, and blue. So we need blue, red, and a pencil for today's lesson. First, we will go through the homework that we had the last time, and then we will go through and finish uh, or pick up where we left off in the last lesson. Okay, so our homework was on page 70, question one. Cross out the odd shape uh, in each set, okay? So here in A, we had a cube and then another cube, a pyramid or a triangle, and then another cube. The pyramid or the triangle was the odd one out. Here we have a circle, a cylinder, circle 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 or balls they can also be balls so ball cylinder ball 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 the odd one out is the cylinder okay here we have a square or a cube square or cube square square and square hmm they all look almost the same right well although they are all they all look like cubes this one is more of a rectangle. The others look like proper squares. This one though, looks like a, a, uh, a rectangle cube. Okay, they're almost the same, but just that the rectangle is a bit different. It looks different. It has longer sides. Okay, so I have a pyramid, a cylinder, Pyramid, pyramid, pyramid. Now, they all look almost the same. They're all triangles, although this one has a circle at the bottom of it. So this one is the one that's different. The other ones don't have a circle at the bottom. So you can see this one is different. Here, we have a cylinder, cylinder. They're all cylinders, except this one is a square, which is a cube. So this one is the one that we're rolling out. These ones are circles and then long circles, but this one is a square or a rectangle and then a big rectangle. So it is different. Okay, so that's it for the homework. Uh, it's okay if you haven't done it uh, because there are different shapes. We didn't take ball, we didn't take cylinder. Uh, so it might be a bit complicated. So uh, we'll go back to it after we uh, finish uh, the units that cover these lessons Okay, so now we will go up again to page 58 Now here we have squares and rectangles. Okay, so a quick review of the Lessons we did before we have four main shapes What's this oh wait, let me draw a bit, bit better hmm. Okay, so what's this? Can you guess? Yes, that's a square. Okay, what's this? Hmm, circle. What's this? Triangle. Okay, we had one more. What's this? It looks like a square, but it is longer here. So this is a rectangle. Okay, so a quick review. Square circle triangle rectangle okay so these are the shapes we drew the last time now let's go back to the book page 58 and we will do today's lesson a square is a special rectangle okay this is a square and this is a rectangle a square is special it's different the sides of a square are all the same length. So the sides of a square here are all the same length. So I'll give you an example in my notebook. Okay, so here's my notebook and I'm gonna draw a square. Okay, let me try, hmm, okay. So I'm gonna use the same length. Okay, so I'm gonna use this one. Okay, let's see if we get a, uh, a rectangle or a square when we use this. Let me see. OK, 
Okay, and then another one. And another one. And the last one. Okay, let's connect this here. So here you can see all sides are the same, the same length from the eraser, right? So here, same, 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 same. This is called a square. Now a rectangle is different. A rectangle uses different sides. So here we can draw a rectangle. We have one side like this, another side like this, and this side is different and this side is different. So what we get here is a rectangle. So this, the length here is different from the length here. Here and here are different. Here and here are the same. So if all the sides are the same, it's a square. All sides are the same. If all sides are not the same, this one and this one are, are the same, this one and this one are the same, but these two are different. So this is called a rectangle. Okay. So that's the difference between a rectangle and a square. Now here, color the squares red and the rectangles blue. Now here's what I want you to do. I will do the first one and then you have to pause the video and do the rest on your own and then check my answers after you finish. Okay, so we have blue and red. Red is for squares and blue is for rectangles, okay? So here, this is a rectangle, so we color it blue. Okay, now this is a square and we color it red. Now go ahead and pause the video, and then after you finish, play it again, and then check your answers. Okay, if you pause the video and you play it again, let's check the answers together. This is a square, so it's red. Okay, this is a square, so it's red. Okay, this is a rectangle, so it's blue. This is a rectangle, so it's also blue. Try not to go out of the lines. I might have gone out a little bit, but you can do much better than I can. Okay, this is a square, so it's also red. And this is also a square, so it's red. Okay, that's very good. Now that we're done with this one, we have a rectangle, square, 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 rectangle, rectangle, square, and square. Okay, so squares are red and rectangles are blue. Great. Now let's count how many squares you can see in each picture. So we have two pictures here. You have to write the numbers for squares and then squares. Hmm. So for each picture, we have to write how many squares we can see. We will add something else, but let's finish this first, and then I'll add what I had in mind. Okay, so let's see, squares. This is not a square. Hmm, square, one, two, three. Is this a square? Hmm, remember, all sides should be the same. This one is long, and this one is short. So no, this is not a square, this is a rectangle. So here, one, two, three. No, four, and the big one is five. So here we have five squares. Okay, now go ahead and pause the video and do this one alone, and then check the answers with me. Go ahead. Okay, if you pause the video and now you're back, let's check. Hmm, 
one, two, hmm, rectangle, no, circle, 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 no. There are only two squares here. Now here's what I wanted to add. Now here we want to write rectangles. Okay, how many rectangles can you see in this picture? This is not rectangle, no. Okay, here, one, two, three. So we have three rectangles. Again, let's write rectangles again. Rectangles. Okay, how many rectangles can you see here? Go ahead and pause the video and come back after you're done. Okay, if you pause the video, let's go ahead. This is one, this is two, this is three, it's, most, it's a long rectangle. So we have three rectangles here. Okay, so that's how many squares and rectangles we have in this picture. Okay, great. Now we can move on to the next one. Count how many there are of each shape. Complete these sentences. Okay, so here. There are gap rectangles, there are gap squares, there are gap circles. So first, let's start with the rectangles. Hmm, I think that's one, and that's two, three, no, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, this looks like a rectangle as well, 15, 16, and I think that's it. So we have 16 rectangles. Okay, now as usual, go ahead and pause the video and then come back when you're done. Okay, if you fit, pause the video and you're back, let's go back right into it. Now there are gap squares. Let's see how many squares we have. Mm, no, 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 no. Mm. One, mm. two. Mm. Seems like we have only two squares. Okay, there are gap circles. Let's see how many circles we have. Now we can count this as one and this as two. Mm, yeah, I think we can just count this as one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Mm, they look like circles, but not all of them. So we can just skip these. So twelve. That's about twelve circles. If you choose to count those, that's okay as well. If you choose to count this as one, that's okay as well. It doesn't have to be the same, exact same answer. It just have to, has to make sense. So whenever you go back and the color and the, the number you have is different, just remember that there are different ways you can count this. This can be one, two, three. But what I did was one, two, three, four, five, six because they look like two circles to me so you can count them as one or you can count them as two that's really up to you so if your answer is different that's really fine it's okay it doesn't have to be exactly the same okay now for the assessment complete each name match the shape to its name okay so here we're going to have to write the, the names of these shapes and then we have to match them with the pictures that we have here now, this is going to be your homework for today, and I'm just going to do the first one so it's very clear what you have to do. Okay, so which shape starts with an R? Let's go back and check. Hmm. Rectangle. Okay, so we can take the spelling. Rectangle, rectangle. Okay, here's the spelling. We can do this. Never guess the spelling. Always copy. Okay, not in tests, but always copy. Here, you can copy the spelling from here. R E C T A N G L E. 
rectangle. Okay, so which of these shapes is a rectangle? C, that's right. So I have to match it, match it like this. You could just write, uh, instead of just, right, just writing C, that will confuse you. So don't write C, just connect it like this. Rectangle. Okay, that's your homework for today. I hope it's easy enough. If you have any problems with it, that's okay as well. You can always go back to this page and see that you have all the shapes here and you can copy the spelling from here and write it here and if you have any problems that's okay because we will do it in the next lesson now just a quick review i'm going to draw the shapes and i want you to listen and repeat just to make sure that you memorize all the shapes okay so first we have what's this hmm well, let me finish and we will do all of them. What's this? Okay. What's this? All right. What's this? Okay, so I'm gonna say them and you have to listen and repeat and check if you answer them properly and correctly or not. Square, 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 circle, 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 triangle, 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 rectangle, rectangle, rectangle. Okay, so all of these are called shapes. Okay, so in this lesson, I want you to remember the word shapes, okay? So shapes means all of the things that you can see that are circle, square, triangle, or rectangle, they are called shapes, okay? So listen and repeat, shapes, shapes. Okay, that's very good. Thank you for watching. I hope you learned something new today. Uh, if you have any problems, you can always comment in the video and I will always answer and try to help you the best i can you can even post your answers in the comments below and i will try to answer them and help you if there are any mistakes thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next lesson goodbye